Good morning, guys. Well, it's official. Ugh, D B E J C K summer vacay is officially over. Nay, it is over physically, but mentally and in our hearts, D B E J C K lives on. Am I right, Calvin? Yeah. What was your favorite part of the trip, guys? Um, my favorite part was swimming. Swimming, Calvin. What did you like best? When you were at a thing, I got a trip and. When Jackson tripped and didn't go on a ride with me? Yeah. I don't remember also that part. Made or ate or springs. <laughs> this is completely irrelevant to the topic of conversation. What is going on? Why are you talking about that? That was Disneyland, not DBEJCK Summer Vacay. Either way, okay, here's my next question. Do you want to say anything to Ollie and Finn and Gaines and Brooks? Yeah. What? Well, I miss Ow. you guys. I hope we. See you soon. Oh, that's so nice of you guys. Well, you I say would anything? just say I am Finn. Oh, what do you want to say to Ollie and Finn? I like you so much. I will give you a treat for you every time. <laughs> Oh, a treat for you every time. That is just the sweetest. Oh, well, we miss everyone. But if you guys want to check out all the videos, I'm going to make a playlist of everyone's DBEJCK Summer Vacay videos, and you can all watch them all in one place on repeat until the next time. I wonder how many times you would actually watch them if you did it on repeat until the next DBEJCK. Anyway, Ellie is gone. She's out of town. She is on a plane to New York City right now as we speak to take care of some business, and it's just me and the boys. So that means we're going to party. I hear a little something now. Let's peek inside and see what it is. It might be our favorite baby. Yes, it is. Tommy. Hi, buddy. Good morning. Did you sleep good? Yeah, you did? Oh, I'm so happy to hear that. We have such a big day today, such an exciting event that's going to happen today, and we need to get you ready for it. Okay, bud? Here comes our baby Tommy now. Let's see him smile from ear to ear. <laughs> now that we have comments re-enabled, do you have to tell me, is there anything better than a baby smile? Huh? Anything better? I dare say there is not. I dare say it. Maybe when a baby says your name for the first time. Like that's pretty sweet. <laughs> when I was a kid, all the way up until high school, probably starting at Jackson's age, there was something that was more important to me than anything in the whole entire world, and that was baseball. I loved baseball. I played baseball. I dreamt about baseball. I watched all of the games. It was my passion, my soul, everything. I'd wake up at six in the morning to watch Sports Center, to watch all of the top 10 plays and all of that stuff. And now is the time where our little boy Jackson, you get to play baseball. Are you so excited? Yeah. Yeah, today is your very first game. How do you feel? Yeah, I did. Good, are you excited? Yeah. Game. You're gonna play on the field. You're not just gonna watch, you're gonna play. You're gonna hit the ball, you're gonna throw the ball, you're um, gonna hopefully catch the ball. I don't know if I'm gonna catch the ball. You try your very hardest and that's all you need to do, okay? okay. We had a few tears in Alabama, Florida. Alabama, Florabama. Florabama. Florabama, that's right. Uh, because we missed Jackson's first game. Well, I'll tell you one thing. Do you want to know the good news? Yeah. The good news is they actually canceled the yeah. first game. Yeah. Tommy's excited because of the weather. So this is technically the first game still. Isn't that cool? We didn't miss a game, buddy. High five. So we are going to get ready and we're going to practice. There's a couple things that we need to get. There's a couple things that we need to do. You gotta show us how you tee. This is tee ball. We're gonna show you how to hit off the tee, throw the ball, catch the ball, all that good stuff. And then later today, we're gonna go to the game. Does that sound good? A little later this afternoon. Should we go practice in the backyard? Yeah. You're gonna learn how to play too. Do you wanna learn how to play baseball, huh? Do you? Do you wanna learn how to play baseball? Wow. Oh yeah, and we're gonna run around the bases, aren't we? Let's go! Are you ready, Tommy? Are you gonna be the umpire, huh? Are you gonna come outside and be our umpire? Oh, or you're just gonna eat the carpet. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny? You think it's funny eating the carpet? All right, let's do a little inventory check before we start practicing. Do you have your glove? Yes. Check, do you have your bat? Check. Check, do you have the ball? Check. 
Check. Does Daddy have his mitt? Yes, he does. Do we have the audience, the spectators, the fans? Yes, we do. Check and check. You ready to practice a little bit? Yep. All right. The most important rule about baseball is keeping your eye on the ball. Eye on the ball. Eye on the ball. Okay. Eye on the ball. Okay. Eye on the ball. Okay. You got it? Okay. Yeah. All right. So, you put the ball on the tee, and then what's really important is to have a good stance, okay? So, you want your feet shoulder width apart just about maybe a little bit further okay. bend your legs yep and then hands together on the bat bring your bat back like this and then when you swing you take a small step and swing level okay whoa nice matrix move let's try that again good dodge bend your legs a little bit choke up on the bat we, we can't choke well, it's not choking the bat, it's called choking up. It means raise higher. Now get in your batting position. Okay, now go for it. Hey, good hit, bud. That was great. I'm gonna hit it again. What I want you to focus on this time, Jackson, is try not to hit the black and try just to hit the ball. Good, that was better. So this is what you do. You have the ball there. Bend your knees a little bit. Then you bring your bat back like this. So what I'm gonna do, I want a nice level swing straight across. Bring your bat back up. Keep your eye on the ball. And that is how you hit a home run, buddy. That's so crazy. I saw that. You saw it? Yeah. How far did it go? It, went, it just hit me a little bit. And right there. Oh, wow. That's cool, huh? All right, Big Show. Let's see it. Yeah, that's great. Hey, good hit, bud. Oh. Oh, I almost got it. Oh, and you made it to first base. You're safe. Good hit, bud. That was great. Try again. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, next up to bat is Calvin. Calvin is up to bat. He's ready to rock and roll. We've got a runner on first base. He's not actually on first base. He should be on first base, though, because we can throw it to you and check you out. But next up is Calvin. Go ahead and swing, buddy. Oh, hit the T. Didn't quite hit the ball. Try again. Hey, you hit the ball. Good job. He's running to second base and he's running to first base, but he doesn't know where first. Oh, he's tackling him. It's turned into football or rugby. Oh, now it's WWF. We've got a WWF fight. Or sorry, is it WWE now? It's WWE. Now. I think we got to practice a little bit more with you, huh, buddy? Last one. Hey, you've got it! Now run to first base, drop the bat and run to first base! Go into second base! We've got- Oh, he's still going- Oh, he's, oh, he's going for the tackle again! What in the world? I think we need to have a little uh, look at the rule book, wouldn't you say there, guys? Yeah. yeah. I can't remember if there's been a time on the vlog where I've talked about my love for baseball because most of what you've heard was about pole vaulting. I played baseball all growing up from the time I was Jackson's age until I got into high school. And in high school, I kind of had a bad experience with, with baseball. I wasn't the best player on the team, but I was pretty dang good. At least I thought so. I was definitely good enough to play. And in high school, it was the first year that they had tryouts for the baseball team. And everyone that I grew up playing baseball with, tried out on the team, made the team. It was just kind of like this group that had been playing together for so many years. And I didn't make the cut. And it was really, really weird. And I talked to the coach afterwards and it was all just kind of like fishy. And then like a week or two later, I had a class with him because he was also a high, school, a high school teacher. And he asked me to come out and play and it, it just was weird. Like it just didn't feel right. It, I, I don't know. Ultimately what ended up happening is I, I finished out my freshman year playing baseball, but it just didn't feel like it did before. Um, I didn't have the, the desire, the love that I used to. And then I switched to pole vaulting and then instantly fell in love with that. And I felt like I did, I exceeded the ability that I had in baseball to pole vaulting. I felt like I did a lot better there, but I don't know if I've ever told that story before. I was cut from the baseball team and then brought back to the baseball team. <laughs> and it was, it was just interesting. And I hope it's not necessarily a give up story like i didn't feel like i gave up i felt like i just moved on to something different that ultimately i enjoyed more and received a bigger benefit from 
both physically, mentally, and I was able to help others with that too. So seeing Jackson, I think this is the coolest part about this, is seeing Jackson go through the same exact things that I did when I was a kid, picking out your first mitt, getting your first jersey, I think is so cool. I, I think that my first year playing baseball, um, where I grew up, we would have sponsors and their logo would be the shirt. My team was sponsored by an OBGYN, which I think sounds hilarious. A little league baseball team being sponsored by an OBGYN. Let's go gynecologist, yeah! <laughs> my parents got a kick out of that. I feel like my life has been saved a little bit. At least dinner has been saved. We just got back from our trip. We were gone for about a week. We don't have a ton of food in the pantry. I don't wanna get all of the kids in the car and get something to eat. Luckily, before we left, I mentioned that we had a HelloFresh delivery coming right when we got back. And guess what? Thank you, HelloFresh. You're saving dinner yet again. I don't have to leave my house. I can cook this meal all ready to go. Let's see what we're gonna have tonight. Cajun blackened chicken and rice bowls, yum. HelloFresh does all the planning, meal prep, and shopping for you so you guys can focus on having a healthier and happy family dinner time. And thank goodness that's what's happening for me today. Everything comes to your door in pre-measured ingredients and comes with a six step instructional card so it couldn't be easier to make it. It's delivered to your door every week. Oh, don't you worry, this is just the beginning. Doesn't this look so good and delicious? Okay, we're almost there. There are three plans to choose from. There's the classic, the veggie, and the family plan, and you can switch between those plans at any time to fit your style and your needs. smell it I wish you could just 30 minutes later we've got a delicious meal for me and my family oh it smells good it looks good let's find out mm. pardon me it tastes good too I always love seeing the final products because they look as good as they taste they taste as good as they look it really is a great meal HelloFresh looks delicious it tastes delicious and is now from $6.99 per serving if you guys would like to try out HelloFresh which we absolutely love I'll have a link in the description down below where you guys can get started with eight free meals that's $80 off your first month of HelloFresh by using the code Ellie and Jared 80 at hellofresh.com like I mentioned I'll have all of the information in the description down below. And we wanna thank HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. But I gotta dish up the rest of this food for the kids. Tommy, we gotta get you fed, and then we gotta go to a baseball game. You want some more food? Yeah. Well, this is a change of scenery. Um, just maybe 30 minutes ago, it was perfectly sunny and beautiful and bright. And now we've got thunderstorms, so I'm gonna call the coach, see what's happening. It's starting to rain. They'll probably just move the game inside somewhere, but. I'm just so excited for my game. You are, I'm so glad. Calvin is leading the pack. It's probably because it's raining. We're going to this new indoor facility and we're gonna watch Jackson play his first game. You ready, bud? Is this my first time playing baseball at um, a stadium? Yeah, it is. Okay, let's go inside. Let's meet your team. Okay, Jackson's up to bat. I think this is like a little practice that they're gonna do before the game. Okay, let's see it, bud. Oh, what a good hit. Oh my gosh, it's going all the way to the outfield. He just hit it into the outfield again. <laughs> okay, let's see it again, Jackson. Come on, buddy, show me how it's done. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's your grandson right there. Right, right. <laughs> oh, look at you with that spit up on your mouth. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> Are you ready to see Jackson play? Yeah. Yeah? That's so cool. Good hit, Jackson. Run, run, run. Keep running, run, run, run. Good job, Jackson. <laughs> no, Jackson, you stay at first. You stay at first, Jackson. Okay, Jackson, you go to second. <laughs> you ready to play some defense? Good job. You're doing great, bud. Oh, he's going to play third base. Awesome. He's like, yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna stand here. That's okay. Good job, Jackson. Way to run up on the ball. Jackson's team is walking off the field, and I'm just wondering how long it takes before he realizes that he's still out there. He hasn't noticed yet. He's still looking around. Jackson, your team has gone off the field. Different teams on the field. Are you? Just, uh oh, he's belly itching. He's literally belly itching. Jackson, 
Your team, your team's over there now. There you go. Okay, Jackson, the bases are loaded. No pressure. Whoa, good hit, bud. Keep running, keep running, run, run, run. Go run, run, run. Take two, take two. Run to second base. Miles, throw the ball in. Throw the ball in. Oh, run back to first base. <laughs> run all the way home. <laughs> Good job, Jackson. See you, Jax. Good hit, whoa! Good hit, Jackson. Keep running, keep running, keep running. All the way, buddy, keep running. Keep running. Good job, keep running. Faster, faster. <laughs> keep going, keep going. Oh, or just stop. <laughs> Wiping the sweat off his brow because he's been working hard, huh? <laughs> How was that? Good job, bud. It was fun. Did you love it? You hit so good. Okay, yeah, for sure. We will definitely will. I probably just a few days. Okay. Grandma asked you what your favorite part was. My favorite part is batting. Batting. You did so good batting. You hit it so far. I was so I, I, I never got to catch it. Yeah, well, you got to move if you want to do that. <laughs> we'll practice some more, okay? We'll practice some fielding, okay? One thing I'm really proud about is like when he did move to the ball, he was not afraid of the ball at all. He ran and, and you tackled the ball, <laughs> didn't you? You jumped on top of it, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> how sweet. <laughs> Cousin Ann is here to celebrate with Jackson, but not only that, we've got Uncle Ryan. How's it going? It's going good. How are you? Good. You didn't have to come all the way from Colorado to watch Jackson's game. That's so but nice we of you. I wanted to support Jackson. I really appreciate hey, that. That's welcome. so nice of you guys. I just got Tommy into bed and I'm looking for the boy. Are you guys, boys, are you in my office? What are you guys doing? Oh my gosh. What are you guys doing? Um, Calvin wants his baby So you're putting tape on it? Yeah. Is this what you want, Calvin? Yeah. <laughs> Is it working? Yeah, it's working. Oh, good, I'm glad. Oh, so if you're going from baseball star to superheroes. Is that what you guys are doing tonight? It's <laughs> the last one, Calvin. Okay, I'll meet you guys downstairs. Except Flash, you'll probably be there before I will, huh? Okay, we rallied the troops. We got into bed. Did you guys have a good day today? Yeah. Jackson, I'm so proud of you at baseball. You did awesome. Yeah, but I... Oh, it was so hard catching it. Yeah, well you'll learn. That's all about practice. It takes years to get really good at baseball, okay? So we're gonna start now. Sound good? Yeah. Calvin, did you have a fun day today? Yeah. Good, Hello. I'm so glad. We are going to say goodnight to these boys and to you guys. In fact, boys, do you want to say goodnight to mommy? Goodnight. She flew all the way to New York. Goodnight, mom. Goodnight, mom. Do you guys miss mom? Yeah. Okay, we'll see um, her very, very soon. Um, Tomorrow or the day after. You know what? I can't even remember. <laughs> I don't even know. I haven't even thought about it. But that's going to be it from us, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up, and we will see you guys next time. Bye! Bye! <laughs>